Hello YouTube. Here's my red, white, and blue decor collection that I made. All of my little stuff things in my in the background. You see my patchwork uh, quilt banner back there with the birds on it. I love that thing. <laughs> Everything that I'm showing you are handmade. Like, for instance, this here, that metal bucket, you know I didn't make that. I got that from the dollar store. <laughs> so all of my things, like this elephant, for instance, I made this elephant. And as you can see, my um, star and my birds are patchwork. I just made that from scraps of material i love those birds i have three birds <laughs> and let's see what i'll get in my kitchen sink in there see my blue bird and the red white and blue one and the black one yeah and then sorry for this angle and then i'll show you guys my bears there's my bear one of them there's the hat. I told you guys I was making those hats for them. And also in the background back there, you see with that red, white, and blue ball. On each side, that red, white, and ball, blue ball are some um, unicorns. Red, white, and blue unicorns. I made those. Everything I made with my hand. I just don't, I don't know. I have a sewing machine, but sometimes I just sit down in my chair and I just, in front of the computer as I watch videos and stuff and I get to sewing stitching with my hand and I just make stuff so these are some of the things I've made and I just want to come in here and share everything with you guys hope you guys enjoy this video there goes my red white and blue miss bird the hat like I said come to the Dollar Tree the elephant there's another elephant and here are some red white and blue apples I call them apple my apples the fireworks I got that from Tuesday morning couple of years ago or a year ago or something and now here's my other bear a red one she has a mole I put on her face I put a mole on her <laughs> there's her hat you guys remember the hats I made and um she's adorable I have to take pictures and put on my Facebook page for my family to see family hope you guys enjoy mom's um red white and blue decor and my G babies hey you guys what's up <laughs> love y'all and also and my sisters and my brothers hey guys just saying hello <laughs> through this video <laughs> y'all don't forget to watch my video and then here's one another red white and blue apple that i made that's another apple okay we're coming in a dark territory this is my little kitty cat that i made the red white and blue kitty cat y'all can see this is on the curate Say hello to the birdie. Hey, birdie. He's company. I did not make the birdie. That came from the Dollar Tree. And here's the blue bear. I guess. I don't know. Can y'all see the blue bear? So it's three bears. It was a red, white, and blue bear. I probably have to make a video of showing them so you guys can really see them in another video. And here go, here's a jar. Some mason jars that I covered up to make them look like pan pineapples. I just covered them up with material and just sprigged it up at the top, put a bow around the neck. And there we are. Pineapple jars. The red one's sitting in the cut. It's kind of dark back there, but the black one is here. Probably have to make another video and show you guys where y'all can really see it. I'm so sorry for the lightning here. And here's some more uh, soda pop sitting on this thing right here. I'm trying to stay out of the junk area, you guys. <laughs> Try to show y'all what's neat. Anyway, this is just um, some of the things I have been working on to help celebrate the red, white, and blue holidays. Hope you guys enjoy my video. Family, hope you guys enjoy Mom's, G-Mom's video. I just want to share y'all with you guys what Mom's been doing. G-Mom's been doing, making all my little collections. So one day, <laughs> you guys can have them. <laughs> oh, my God. But, yeah. This is what the G mom, the mom, been working on. And I love every minute of it sewing on my hand. 
and sharing my work well that's it you guys that's all that's everything hope you guys enjoyed this video and i know i said in a previous video that i said that um i think that i will cut back on supporting people through shout outs i feel good about really saying that when i thought about it because that's the way that we help each other support each other's channels and stuff and i like to help do it even though i think that is the way well anyway i'm going to shout out names you know the names come through i'll shout them out to help people send people to folks channel that need people that don't quite know how to go out and find people or don't have the time to go out and find people so i volunteer to help so hmm that's what it's all about. We need to support each other. That's how you get your channels to grow also. That's one way. If you don't go out and find friends, you have your sub friends send friends to your channel. That's the way it's supposed to work. You shout out people and then they say, oh, thank you. And then they send folks over to your channel. That's how we, one way of helping grow others' channels. Because we're going to need a lot of help if a lot of us wants to be monetized. We need 4,000 hours. That's a lot of hours. That's a lot of viewing. So, if you want that, you got to help support each other. You need to help. Don't be selfish. Don't be mean. Do what you got to do to get people to your channel because stuff needs to be done. The work has to be done. Well, that's it. That's all. I've talked too much. i said too much. But I enjoy my um, subscribers. Thank you. Any new subscribers, thank you. You appreciate it. And... I have a schedule. Check out my schedule playlist so you'll know the uh, days I come and visit certain categories of on the on the YT. So check that video out so you guys will know when I do come and visit you. Even though I will leave a comment saying I'll see you this day, I'll see you next day, whatever. You guys know how it go. So and also to all you guys that say, "Ooh, Janita, you almost got a thousand subs." Yes, thank you very much. And it was hard work getting those people to come. And for people that see, well, Janita have a lot of people coming to her channel and commenting and, you know, and visiting. That's because Janita goes to those people's channels and comments and visits and supports. And the same thing for you all, it can happen to you too. You have to go and visit, folks. You can't just sit there and think people just go magically come to your channel. Yeah, sure, a few people probably come, but not everyone. You have to go out and support. You have to go visit. And comments are very important. Leave a comment. That's so that people will know that you've come. Because you can't tell if you don't leave a comment. Views are great. But please leave a comment because I know I would sure like to know who came and visit me. Because you all know I'd leave comments on your channels when I come and visit and let everybody say amen to all the folks that know i come and visit them and that's why you come to visit me that's why i give support and i get support and i thank you and bless all you guys for helping me out because we all need to help and i ran my mouth and rattled on and i know you guys are busy and whenever you guys get a chance to watch this video i appreciate you thank you so much have a blessed day and i hope that the lightning was good on here at least a little bit Hope you guys enjoy and until the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.